channel, I'm my a Colombian girl living in Melbourne. A couple of weeks ago, my boyfriend and I went to Delsford, which is kind of like a one hour and a half away from Melbourne. But there are plenty of things to do. So in today's video, I'm gonna share with you what to do, where to stay, what to visit. Stay here. I'm wearing fake eyelashes. Can you tell? The first thing, where to stay? Well, you shouldn't have a problem finding where to stay because Dalesford is a pretty common touristy place to go. So there are plenty of hotels, but if you don't want to stay at the hotel, you can stay at a bed and breakfast. And if that is not for you, then you can go on Airbnb and find what fits your needs. And I found this villa, it's called Bella Vista Villa. It's amazing. Oh my God, it's beautiful, it's cozy. It's outside Delford, like a five minute drive from Delford. It has a massive spa outside, it has a bath bathtub inside. The house is very very cozy, it has its own kitchen. If you want more information about this amazing place to stay, I will leave the details down in the description box. The second thing, what to do, what to visit? Well, there are plenty of things to do in Delsford. These are just my top five. In Australia, there is a very famous brand of water called Mount Franklin water. Well, Mount Franklin, the mountains are located in Dalesford. You can take walks around. You can also camp there, like do camping there. We didn't stay, we have our cabana, but it's a really nice place to visit. The second place that you cannot miss is the Dalesford Lake. It's an amazing lake in the middle of the town. and you like hiking and walking and exercise and yeah pretty much adventures then there is a guy in Dalesford that you can rent a map with a compass and you can go explore the forest around the town and you can go from I don't know one hour walks to four hour walks this is done by a business called The Secret walks of this for something like that again i will leave all the details down in the description box the fourth thing that i recommend you doing while in this force of course is visiting and walking around the town it's a main street there are plenty of restaurants little boutiques clothing accessories homeware there's a massive bookshop and it's a full house all the rooms are full of books, second-hand books, but you can also buy like brand new books. Stairs to go and old books, comics. And if you are into books, this is a store that you cannot miss. And finally, the fifth thing that you should do is to go to a spa or to go to a place to get a massage. Because Delford is known as the Australian capital of spas. There are so many spas and so many places that you can get massages and all type of beauty therapies kind of thing. And finally, where to eat. There are plenty of restaurants, as I mentioned before. I found three restaurants that if I have a chance, I will go back like this. The first one is Lavandula Trattatoria. Trattatoria. Well, I don't know how to pronounce that, but Lavandula Trattatoria. Lavandula Trattatoria. Lavandula Trattatoria is a lavender farm that has gardens with lots of lavender. They grow lavender and they create products made of lavender. So if you like lavender, you have to go there because it's like your dream job. But also they have a very lovely quirky cafe inside the garden. So yes, you do have to pay like, I think it's eight dollars six dollars to go in but you can get amazing food if you go i do recommend you to get the platter it's a mix of thin sweet savory meat salads and apart from that you can go and enjoy the gardens there is a little lake it's just very relaxing you can do a picnic there people go and do picnics i did see someone with a picnic bag i think my second recommendation is a place called salt it's a fine dining I went there two years ago and it was quite an experience. I think just before this time, it was my favorite fine dining restaurant in my life. 
it's located at a winery I think and it's a beautiful place if you want to get married and you're looking for a perfect location to get married that's the place they have like a little church outside and then the restaurant is beautiful the food was delicious and finally my favorite restaurant in Dalesford has to be Katsuki Katsuki's 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 I think it's Katsuki's <laughs> there are two options in this restaurant you can get the five course dinner or the seven course dinner we got the five courses dinner delicious food I mean I never tasted something that good it was a great dinner I had a great time don't get me started with the dessert I can't remember what it was oh it was delicious it was delicious so there you go that was a quick guide for Dalesford. I really recommend you to go and visit Dalesford. It's not that far away. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I'm a Colombian girl living in Melbourne. Thank you so much for watching and see you next week. 